Benvenuti a bordo e questo volo all'Italia. Bravo. Bravo. It's a really, really cute Shiba Inu dog here. So excited, first time flying all'Italia. I just learned my second Italian word, spaghetti. All the ladies, if you're watching this video, come fly all'Italia. Look at, super handsome. Hello, hi, my name is Massimo. I'm a flight attendant. Hello, Captain. Thanks for coming down to see me, Captain. Hello. Hello. And as you can see, you have two choices. Here, the Italian one uh, and the Japanese choice. Actually, just smells really amazing. This beer, Bellissimo, right? Oh, Bellissimo. This is a famous yeah. Italian soda. Let's try capsule in here. And... Oh, Bellissimo. He makes 300 pizza every day. This one. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Okay. It's a really, really cute Shiba Inu dog here. He's going to Milan. Lucky him, going to Europe today. Long haul flight to Rome on the triple seven. Wanted to fly for a long time, but first time doing it. Buongiorno. Buongiorno. I know one you? Italian word. No, two. Two now? You know two words. What's Buongiorno. the second word I know? Spaghetti. Spaghetti? Yeah. Oh, what, that's what an Italian you? word. Sure. Oh. And your name is? Fabio. Fabio. I just learned my second Italian word. Spaghetti. Grazie. 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 Oh my god. All the ladies, if you're watching this video, come fly Alitalia. Look at super handsome. Are you a footballer or do you play sports? Oh my god, you're amazing looking. Benvenuti a bordo sul nostro volo. So this is the um, blood orange water and uh, our traditional uh, champagne. Oh, have a glass of champagne. <laughs> this is our brochet, don't forget. I'm super excited. It's my first time flying long haul Alitalia and today my flight is very on time. I'm going to give you some tip though. If your flight is not on time, you might be eligible to up to $700 compensation. Check the compensation with air help. I'm going to show you how easy the compensation process is. The European regulation EC261 law protects air passenger rights on flights within the EU, leaving EU on any airline or arriving EU with a European airline. Air help can help on following cases. Deny boarding, flight cancellation, or long flight delay. The claim process is super easy to manage. There are no extra paperwork. Submit your claim online and let Air Help to manage the claim and send you the compensation. Let me walk you through a complete process here. On Air Help, type in your flight origin and destination. First, Air Help will ask a few simple questions to determine whether you are eligible for compensation. Select what happened to the flight, how long was it delayed, and what did the airline say about the reason of delay. If eligible, you'll be then asked to fill in the personal details, address, booking reference, signature, and upload a booking confirmation. Once the claim is submitted, you'll receive a tracking link of your case, and AirHelp will follow up the claim and request your bank details to send you compensation if the claim is accepted. No win, no fee. AirHelp can also import all your flights from your email. Once the flights are imported, AirHelp will automatically check eligible flights and alert you by email. Here I've got an email from AirHelp, which found me an eligible claim. In fact, AirHelp can search flights up to three years in the past for claims. Give AirHelp a try now. You can get as much as $700 in compensation. The link is in the video description. My name is uh, Luca Van Zandt and today I have the first officer, Renato Portuto, to justify the aircraft. 
For the last hour, the takeoff has been uh, switching from northbound to southbound, so the flight time will last uh, a little bit longer than uh, usual. Anyway, we are calm here to land on schedule. Italian drinks. Also, what do you suggest? I like to have Italian. Right, the pasta of course, the pasta of Pandora is typical Italian. Pasta of yeah, Pandora. By the way, I'm really surprised. This is Italian fashion. Look at the it's uniform. It's a new here. uniform, yeah. Whoa. It's a new uniform. I hope you have one for me. I like to wear one too. Okay, right. <laughs> Hello, Captain. Thanks for coming down to see me, Captain. Yeah, this oh. is such a warm welcome on Alitalia. It's my first time. Your first time? First time on the Italia. international flight, Alitalia. Oh, Before I flew MD-80. Ah, oh, I yeah. used to fly MD-80 as well. Oh, so. special. MD-80 is a very special plane, you know? <laughs> yeah, thank you. Okay. Right. Well, I'm on board then. So. And you're Angel Captain flight. Luca, right? I'm Captain Luca. I'm living on the second floor. Maybe you have seen me before. <laughs> living second floor. Okay. <laughs> oh, Captain, tell us how long is the flight time today? Yeah, the flight is going to last uh, 12 hours and 20 minutes today. Oh, long uh, flight. Headwind. Oh, yes, a little bit longer than usual, but I mean, it's uh, quite normal from this time of the year. Uh -huh. So, I'm gonna, gonna go uh, straight up to Russia now, right? Japan. We are just leaving right now Japanese airspace and getting to Russia and cross Siberia all the time, and then crossing Eastern Europe and uh, crossing the Balkans in Adriatic Sea, landing over the Italy, Italian airspace, and that's it. Okay, one more question. How far north we fly in terms of latitude? Yes, the maximum latitude we're going to reach today is 73 degrees centigrade. Uh, 73 70 degree. degrees north? Yes. But Captain, I want to tell you one thing. I'm a plane spotter. I ah. watch Alitalia take off many times in Los Angeles. Yes. It's Alitalia, I think, 620. Yes. Something like that. 620 is landing in La landing landing to LA. 621 is 621. Landing now, every time Alitalia, I think they use full power takeoff. They take off less than half the runway. They can rotate already. We almost never use full power because uh -huh. full thrust. We full say thrust. Full thrust. Yeah. Uh, because you know to say the engines, if you're not so heavy, you don't need yeah. all the power. You know, yeah, so yeah, you yeah. Know, not thrust. So you know to reduce this kind of stress on the machine and to reduce the chance of any failures we could happen, we use a so-called flexible or derated uh -huh. takeoff technique. But I think in Los Angeles, every time I see you guys rotate very fast. Well, the actual, uh, you have to think about, um, the important part is, you have to think, if one of the two engines is going to fail, you uh -huh. have to still have enough space, whether to break the aircraft or to take off with only one engine, because it's possible to take off with one engine after specific speed. Thank you. I just talked to Captain, and uh, he flew MD-80, but before that, he flew many years ago, MD-11. What a legend, MD-11. My favorite aircraft. Oh, you. yes. I missed it. This is a good galley, right? The 777, nice galley to work. It is, actually it is. Yeah, it's a huge galley, look at this. Actually, what I'm going to show you is uh, what you're going to have in the uh, premium economy. So it's a uh, different service with uh, different trades, it's wider. And as you can see, you have two choices. Here, the Italian one with a very good lasagna and a chicken salad. Uh, and the Japanese choice. Yeah, dark meat. Yeah. Uh, with the Japanese, like a soba noodle. Yeah, and of course they are all made in Japan, but with Italian products. Flying out of Italia, better try Italian food. The lasagna actually just smells really amazing. 
full of Italian aroma, full of cheese aroma actually. Economy class, the uh, Italian option and the Japanese option, the meals are very different. The Italian starter is like this green beans with uh, cold meats. And the Japanese starter is actually like a uh, condiment and lotus roots and totally different. And then the Japanese one has green salad in there. And the Italian option has fruit inside. The Japanese one also has a cute, uh, like a fruit jelly here. And uh, the Italian one has cheese on it. Marco, like this beard, this beard, beautiful Italian beard. You did it yourself, Italian yeah, beard. By myself. Oh. This beard, bellissimo, right? Oh, bellissimo. Bellissimo. <laughs> Let me touch your beard. Oh, very, very nice trim. I don't know how men do this because I couldn't maintain. I want to grow, but when I grow, and then you look very messy. Look like I'm yeah. a homeless guy, you know? It takes time. Oh. It takes just time. How many? How long it took you to? Uh, it's one year? No, it's a month. This is my first time trying out one of these Big Shell Premium Economy seats. I must say I'm not very used to it. Spritz. Cheers, that's Cheers. Apero Prosecco and uh, sparkling water. Apero Prosecco, Prosecco and, and sparkling water. water. This is a famous yeah. Italian soda, right? This is yeah, Italian yeah, it's cocktail. Quite, uh, typical from the north. Amazing, thank you. Thank you. Italy and Alatal is very famous for his coffee, so I'm gonna try out one. So, coffee, we have intense, the caffeine, uh, well balanced and aromatic. Which kind do you prefer? Aromatic, uh, this is decaf. Intense. Intenso. And this one, well, well balanced. balanced. Well, I wanna try this one, the okay. Grand Prima. Okay. okay. Ready? Oh, that's quick. That's really quick coffee. Yeah. I prefer this one. Okay, coffee let's try. Strong, strong one. Yes. Strong one. Let's try. So you put the capsule yes. oh, in here and just yes. push down. So trying out two different coffees. The first one is a balanced one. It's called Grand Firma. Actually, this is Adriana. She made the coffee for me here. She's from Palermo in Sicily. In Sicily. Okay. <laughs> Smells very nice. I'm not a big coffee drinker to be honest, but I can feel this one is not that strong, right? Now, this see. one, this one is Adriana's favorite. She told me this is the Intenso. This is the strong. I just dressed up in the latest fashion, Italian fashion of Alitalia. Since 15 November, a new uniform came. It's just so Italian fashion. I think I look like now 1% Italian after this uniform. Guys, do you think I have the potential to work for Alitalia? Maybe for one flight. 
Right now, in Rome, expected to be a fair weather, that field cloud, and the temperature is now 6 degrees centigrade. We expect rain on ahead of scale, so probably you're going to appreciate it. And if you enjoy this flight with us, we'll see you again in the next picture aboard our aircraft. So, Sam, how was your Italian flight? Oh, bellissimo! Uh, Napoli. Napoli. Costino. 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 Food is the common language here. You don't need to speak Italian, you can understand. Uh, can I have one glass of the. Uh, what is that one called? Prosecco. Prosecco. Thank you. This lounge has so much Italian food. Look at this. This is the pasta with calamari. Let's go to eat. Wow. It's very authentic, this one. This one's like al dente. I'm just so glad after a long flight from Tokyo, I get to taste the authentic Italian pizza. Okay, and here we have our drawing room that is possible to reserve for our special passenger and some categories. I will show you.